Today, we compare the two largest car companies in the world in terms of the number of cars produced per year, Volkswagen and Toyota. Now imagine how much money you would have earned if you invested only $100 in Volkswagen or Toyota 5, 10, 15 or 20 years ago. Volkswagen was established in 1937 by the German Labour Front in Berlin. Volkswagen Beetle was designed by Ferdinand Porsche's consulting firm and the company was backed by the support of Adolf Hitler. Toyota was founded by Kichiro Toyoda and incorporated on August 28, 1937. Volkswagen is headquartered in Wolfsburg, Germany. Toyota is a Japanese multinational automotive manufacturer headquartered in Toyota City, Aichi, Japan. The Volkswagen Group sells passenger cars under the Audi, Bentley, Cupra, Lamborghini, Porsche, Seat, Skoda and Volkswagen brands. Motorcycles under the Ducati name. Toyota is one of the largest automobile manufacturers in the world, producing about 10 million vehicles per year. Toyota Motor Corporation produces vehicles under five brands – Daihatsu, Hino, Lexus, Rans, and the namesake Toyota. The Volkswagen Group is one of the world's largest employers in the private sector. On December 31, 2021, Volkswagen employed a total of 668,000 people. Toyota's total number of employees in 2021 was 366,283, a 1.87% increase from 2020. The average estimated annual salary, including base and bonus at Volkswagen, is $126,316, or 60 per hour. The average estimated annual salary, including base and bonus at Toyota, is $131,000, or $62 per hour. As of May 2022, Volkswagen has a market cap of $93.47 billion. This makes Volkswagen the world's 136th most valuable company by market cap. As of May 2022, Toyota has a market cap of $238.77 billion. This makes Toyota the world's 36th most valuable company by market cap. Volkswagen's annual revenue for 2021 was $296 billion, a 16.27% increase from 2020. Toyota's annual revenue for 2021 was $255.8 billion, a 7.1% decline from 2020. Volkswagen's annual net income for 2021 was $17.5 billion, an 84.46% increase from 2020. Toyota's annual net income for 2021 was $21.1 billion, a 10.49% increase from 2020. Volkswagen Bank of America pays dollars per share or 2.24%. Bank of China pays 0.028 per share or 2.24%. Volkswagen's annual income taxes for 2021 were $5,558,000,000, a 71.15% increase from 2020. Toyota's annual income taxes for 2021 were $6,011,000,000, a 2.83% decline from 2020. Volkswagen shares were worth $153.74 when the video was recorded. At the same time, Toyota shares were worth $17.43. The largest increase in the company's shares was from 2020 to 2021. The company grew from $99 to $258 or 160%. Toyota shares grew rapidly in the period from 2011 to 2015, from $3.74 to $13.17, or by 251%.
The average annual growth of Volkswagen shares for the last 20 years was 16%. And the average annual growth of Toyota for the last 16 years was 10.8%. The lowest share price in the history of the Volkswagen was $22.10. It was in 2004. Toyota's lowest ever share price was $3.69 in 2011. The biggest drop was in 2014 from $266 to $97 or 63%. During the economic crisis of 2008, the company shares fell from $12.61 to $4 or 67%. As we can see, both Toyota and Volkswagen are equal companies. Volkswagen pays more dividends and has higher average growth, but Toyota, despite lower revenue, has more profit, which can be reinvested in the development of the company which in turn will lead to the growth of the company. Both Volkswagen and Toyota are well suited for long-term investment, but it's only for you to decide invest in them or not. If you liked the video, don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe. By doing this, you will support the channel. Wish you all the best!